Welcome to the special Dairy Foods TV video. Um, I'm joined by uh, Ryan Rosnowski, Halo Top uh, brand director. I'm really excited to have you today, Ryan, because Halo Top has had some great promotions, really interesting stuff that um, is rarely seen in, in the uh, the industry, the dairy related industry. So I wanted to talk to you about some of the promotions you've had just in the past year. You've had a bunch of really cool things, if you could tell me about Um if you could start first with the, um, you offered five uh, $5,000 uh, endorsement deals to top athletes. Can you tell me a, a little bit about that and where the idea came up with that, uh, for that? Yeah, Brian, thanks so much for having me. Really excited to get into some of this stuff with you today. Um, the Halo Top Athletes program, um, super, super exciting for us. It, it came up, you know, as a resolution season kind of was up on us, right? At kind of early January and, you know, we were, we were really inspired by the fact that, you know, everyone tries to do a resolution, right? Half Americans uh, make a New Year's resolution, but only 9% of those people that make that resolution stick to it. And so we were trying to think of ways to, you know, champion that 9%, but also do so in a way that kind of can continue to inspire folks to, um, to, to stick to their resolutions as well. And, you know, the real insight about resolutions is that they're just so restrictive. Right? You're always depriving yourself of something or preventing yourself from doing something that maybe you used to do or maybe you'd want to do as a as an alternative. Um, and you know, it, we thought it was a really interesting place for us to to get involved because Halo Top as a product was designed to basically avoid that restriction, right? Like if you could have your cake and eat it too, that's what Halo Top is supposed to be, right? It is amazing taste, the, all the enjoyment of ice cream, but you know, in a way that's better for you. And so we kind of married that up with resolutions and saying, hey, resolutions feel restrictive. That's what prevents people from, from sticking to them. We can remove the restrictions from the resolutions in the same way that we remove the restrictions from ice cream. Um, and the way that we the way that we chose to do that is by championing that 9% to the Hail Top Athletes program. We wanted to hero those people that already do such a good job. Um, and you know, why do pro athletes and celebrities get all the endorsements, right? Like uh, these are these are folks just like you and I, but with a little extra discipline that are sticking with their resolutions in a way that we thought was a really compelling story and connected just so well to who we are as a brand and the spirit of our product. Yeah, that's great stuff. That's uh, the exercising is one thing I've been able to stick to. Um, when I have a dry January resolution, no, that doesn't work. That much tougher, uh, right? It's <laughs> a lot much tougher. tougher. <laughs> but uh, that's great to hear. Um, and I also want to ask you right before that, um, you, you had a light in the holidays giveaway. Yeah. And you gave out, I, I believe you can correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it was $100,000. Uh, so yeah. so tell me about that, the idea there and, and how that went. Yeah, you're, you're going to catch a theme here, right? Holidays can be the best time of the year. But there is this downside of, oh, it can be really stressful, right? You got to prep for having people over. You got to buy a bunch of gifts. You got to clean the house. You got to put the lights on the house, all the things. Um, and so that that duality in the same way that restriction uh, resolutions can be amazing, but can also be restrictive is what got us inspired as Halo Top, right? Because all the enjoyment, better for you. Um, and so we we wanted to find a way to lighten the holidays in the same way that we've lightened ice cream. Um, and we figured the best way to do that was to take some of the load off, take some of the stress out uh, of people's everyday lives as they prep for the holidays, right? And just let them focus on the amazing parts of it, being surrounded by family and friends and getting the, you know time off of work to enjoy um, all the people you love. Let's focus on that and let's focus less on all of the, the negative components like having to put lights on the house or whatever. And so we did that by offering a whole pile of people you know, I think the I think the grand total was yeah hundred thousand dollars to put towards some of those things that had stressed their holidays, and effect effectively lightening them um, for them in the same way that we've lightened their ice cream. Yeah, great, great, and and I should mention you also had um, ice cream inspired workout gear, which also is on yeah. that theme. Um, and I, I wanted to bring up uh, the the well, ask you about the idea behind the um, you have a. A handbag you created as well, a Halo yeah. Top handbag last year. That that was really cool. So where did the idea for that one come from? Yeah, that I mean that one was fun. Uh, they're super cool too. Uh, I think we might have an maybe I'll send you one, Brian, because they're really really cool. I'm sure I I could catch you walking around with it during the summer. Um, but the 
the impetus behind that was, you know, during the summer, you want to do everything, right? The summer is a time where it's the best time of the year and you want to do all the things. Um, but sometimes you have to make choices, right? Um, do I go to the beach or do I stay home and catch up on some work? Do I, you know, have this burger, even though I know that later it's going to make me feel like I have to go to the gym? You know, you have to make some of these choices. Um, one of those choices was, you know, what kind of snacks or treats you have during the summer, right? And you kind of have, you kind of are measuring, you know, go, go, go all the time. Um, and Halo Top wanted to offer itself up as, look, again, you don't have to choose. You can have your cake, you can eat it too. You can have all of the, the deliciousness of ice cream without any of the downsides, like calories and sugars and fats. And we wanted to make sure we could offer that to people wherever they were, whenever they were, however they were. And so the little, the little handbags are freezer, they're coolers. So you can put the ice cream in, it keeps cold for, you know, two to four hours, give or take, depending on the ambient temperature outside. Um, and you can carry your light ice cream around with you. Um, so that no matter where you are, you, you don't have to choose. You can have your ice cream, you can have your light ice cream and you don't have any of the downsides. Wow. That's, that's a multi-purpose item. That's, that's we, fantastic. we also, <laughs> Brian, during that same time, uh, hired lifeguards around oh, the country, wow. um, to basically be halo top lifeguards and they would go out and catch people in the act of struggling between making a choice like that and say hey don't forget guys you don't have to choose and then you know offer up halo top as a solution to the situation um so that, that was pretty fun because that went hand in hand huh. with the handbags uh, which was which was a fun duality wow i did not know that part that's that's great i'm learning something new as well uh that's awesome i, I want to also ask you about the um how how these uh these are really unique marketing promotions. I I think there's no question about that, and I applaud you there. How are they being um received though? I, I mean, have you been hearing back from the public and and feedback they're giving you, and how is it how is it helping the company? I mean, can you give me a little more there? Yeah, for sure. Um, so I mean, it's really important to us that what we choose to do um is is for our fans, right? Like I. I as a as a brand as a brand team we want to make sure that what our fans actively want sure they want great tasting light ice cream but there's other things too and we want to put ourselves in in that conversation right and add some sort of value beyond just the product that we sell and so that's where getting involved with resolutions getting involved with the holidays getting involved in not having to make difficult choices in the summer um are are things that we feel you know is essential to who our fan is um, and something that we can, you know, uniquely provide um, a support system for. Um, and so when you start with that fan first mindset, the ideas flow pretty quick um, because, I mean, my me and my team, we're all fans too, right? So it's like, what would, what would I want? What would my fan want? What would the Halo Top group community want? Um, and then the ideas follow pretty quickly. And it's just a matter of choosing to do it, right? You won't see a ton of I mean, you won't see a Super Bowl commercial from Halo Top, right? We we put our money elsewhere and, and we try and provide as much value as possible when we do that. Okay. Okay. Great. Great. Great information. Um, yeah. And, uh, and lastly, I wanted to ask you about the uh, the future. So um, I know you, you, I'm sure you can't reveal any of the, the secret new promotions, <laughs> but, but can you tell us, are you going to be continuing these sort of promotions or, and are they going to be on the same sort of line? It, you know, giving out uh, money and giveaways, or, or are they gonna? Are you looking into new ideas and, and different ways to uh, to get to the consumer? Constantly looking into new ideas, Brian. I'm gonna do my best to, to share without giving so much stuff away. But you know, last year we did four or five ish, you know, kind of big moments, big events, um, and we're gonna continue doing stuff like that um, into the distant future, right? We've got no reason to slow down. Um, we've gotten a lot of positive responses from our fans and from new fans uh, alike. Um, and so, uh, you know, we're really excited to be able to continue to keep doing this um, and connecting with the people who care most about our products, you know. Uh, and so we'll, we'll continue to do that through through this year and next year and God willing forever, um, <clears throat> because, it, you know, it, it it inspires us every day to be able to connect with the folks that love our product the most. And that's essentially what that's essentially what these programs are for. Okay, great. Uh, Ryan, thank you so much for joining us on Dairy Foods TV. You got a lot of great information and uh, best of luck in the future with these campaigns. Yeah, thanks so much, Brian. Hope to talk to you soon.